Those are the impacts for sure. Hmm. What track do I want to put them on? So if he scoots across the ground for like 10 frames or something. So the whole thing should So this one's gonna be interesting. I'm gonna try and add some sort of like dirt scrape sound. As if they're getting scooted across the ground. And I have to carry that track brown, otherwise my brain will explode. And I'm going to be listening for some dirt scoot sounds. Ooh, God, that's a good thing. Ooh, I really like that. Ooh, that's going to be for the golem for sure. chunk will fit in this little tiny chunk. So it's a little short. I mean, that's not a lot of time to sell it. So few frames. A lot of times with sound design, you like notice all the little details that you're going to add, and then there just isn't enough like time in, in the actual sound for that to all come through. So you're like put layer upon layer and then you have all these different details, but you know, only like one layer actually makes sense or you can even hear. So sometimes that happens and then you just have to take away you know, some of the sounds that you added. Yeah, that, that doesn't work for that. Gotta be, you know, I might just use the sound that I really liked. Like that. Yep. Gonna use that. Yeah, that one. So let's try that one. 
and I don't really want so much of the impact. I just want um, the scraping again. That totally fits. So let's just chop off. Ooh. And I'm going to compress it. With one of my fancy plugins. Yeah, I see you guys are asking about recording sounds. Um, yeah, this is a sound effects library from a company called Boom, believe it or not. And um, I do record some of my own stuff, but, you know, it's it takes a lot of time to record and then go back and edit them and then, you know, put them in your sound library for, for you to actually, like, use them. So... If there's something out there that already exists, I mean, it's oftentimes it's way more cost effective to uh, buy a sound library. Um, I mean, there is, you know, the danger of like sounding like other people because obviously other people have access to the sound library. But I mean, I'm not just throwing in these sounds as is. Like I'm, I'm trying to add different layers and, you know, manipulate them in other ways. So, you know, I hope I don't sound like someone else. I hope I have a unique voice as a sound designer. But um, you'll see that in, 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 like, big budget movies where, like, oh, yeah, we recorded all of our stuff. Like, um, there's a sound design podcast that I listened to, and they were talking to the, like, field recorder guy for the Lord of the Rings movie. And, like, that was his whole job. Was, all he did was record stuff. And he just recorded, like, it, like everything so they had their own like custom sound effects library i don't know what he said it was but it was you know forty thousand sounds or something ridiculous like that but, you know that's obviously a big budget movie that can afford to pay someone to record for six months but <laughs> yes there is the beard filter it is automatically applied because i have the beard Use this plugin. What? What are you doing? Oh. Where's my EQ curve? Normally I see the high end too. I want a little high end on this thing too, so let's EQ it. Just trying to see where I'm at. Drinking some water. <laughs> it's like a very funny pitchy thing going on with the sound.
Okay. I still need to make this sound like a regular impact, so I'm actually going to kind of build this sound backwards. I probably should start at the swing, but I'm going to work backwards. It's too leathery. I need to get my metal stuff in there. Um. Yeah, I've, I've got OBS, but then you have to get, um, uh, oh, weird. <laughs> I was going to say sound flower, but I just realized my sound flower isn't even running. So you don't need sound flower. Oh, that's right, because I have, uh, um, a multi-output device setup. That's what you. That's what you got to do. Set up a multi-output device, and then uh, in the settings for OBS. Hold on, I'm looking right now. Yeah, you're using that device. You guys can still hear Pro Tools, right? I was doing the metal. Yes. The metal shall be there. I shall make it so. Put it down. 